You're watching Duct Tape and Popsicle Sticks with Mike and Maria Kaiser. Because sometimes you feel like your business is being held together by duct tape and popsicle sticks. On this show, you're not going to hear the latest business fad. You're going to get useful information that you can apply to your own business right now. Hello and thanks for watching another mind-blowing episode of Duct Tape and Popsicle Sticks. I'm Mike Kaiser along with a woman who likes to sneak through restaurants and put fake engagement rings in girls' drinks, oh Maria God. Kaiser. How are you? Is that like the meanest thing you've ever done? <laughs> so, I, I was wondering if you would like that one. <laughs> Hey, everybody, thanks. Thanks a million for joining us. We really, really appreciate it. We love having you along. As usual, everything you need to know is in the show notes below. How to get to our other videos, our podcasts, our brand spanking new website, which is pretty cool. Mm -hmm. But mostly just thanks for being here. And, I, you know, we base most of our shows on things that are happening around us. Things we're going through with clients, with prospects, uh, all sorts of things. So... Mm -hmm. That's how we come up with our show ideas. And I want to talk today about how business owners in 2019 need to be looking at marketing. Okay. Because sometimes we'll hear, you know, I've been running these uh, Facebook posts forever and I've never gotten one new customer okay. from it. We've gotten, you know, we get statements like that and we get it. We're not making anybody bad and wrong. But in this day and age, marketing more than ever has become such an integrated effort a completely integrated effort of all sorts of things including networking and sales mm -hmm. and actually when we were talking about this you have kind of a good analogy sure, for it sure so so imagine if you were setting yourself out on building a house um, you know if you came to that project with only a hammer how much of that house could successfully get built. Now a hammer is a fantastic tool and it's multifaceted but it can only take you so far. So if you're thinking about your marketing don't show up to your marketing with only one tool. Fill your toolbox with multiple tools. So you know have your, have your social media, have your website, have your networking, have your other advertising, have your other components at the ready uh, because you need something to be fully integrated. So I might see you here, but then I'm going to see you there. And I might not even respond to either one of those things till maybe two or three months later when I say, hey, I remember that you did that. I need this thing. And now you don't know really where that came from, but it was all these places that you were seen and heard and your message was conveyed. What a great point. What a great point. And, and think about it this way, that how much people are vying for your attention mm -hmm. no matter what the the medium is whether it's print or social or tv or radio who cares a couple of thousand day, a couple of thousand times a day people are trying to get your attention right right so to think that you and i or, or one of our viewers is going to put out a facebook post and somebody's going to say whoa that company sounds mm -hmm. awesome or that whatever looks great mm -hmm. i want to respond it feels very unrealistic well you know and and they may be responding you just might not know about it how often i'll mm. hear somebody say oh, i loved this week's episode of duct tape and popsicle sticks however there's no evidence of it on the internet it just might show that this it reached this many people and i got this many views but they didn't actually like it they didn't actually compliment comment on it they didn't do anything they didn't join my group as a result of it but they still saw it so we need to understand that the very small percentage of people are actually going to just flock to your stuff but that doesn't mean they're not absorbing it they're not um, enjoying it they're not seeing it and they're not getting anything from it well said. I mean, that's a great way to wrap up. You need to be relevant and visible on the internet, and business development today needs to be a full department, a full effort in your business, right. multifaceted. You, right. I mean, that was great. You got anything else to add? No, I'm good. I mean, I didn't really mean to say our show was so great, but it was. <laughs> um, so, anyway, everybody, thanks a million for watching. We really appreciate it. Our 100th episode is coming up next week, so mm -hmm. we're, I, we're planning something fun or interesting or all of the above for that. Well, you've been awfully secretive, so I'm right. very curious. <laughs> right. It's got to be something great or, or different or 
We'll find out, won't we? And as soon as I know, I'll let everybody else know. <laughs> and in the meantime, you have been watching Duct Tape and Popsicle Sticks, where we make your business better three minutes at a time. Ciao for now. You're watching Duct Tape and Popsicle Sticks with Mike and Maria Kaiser.